This video of um, two Gardaí being viciously attacked violently attacked actually in Ballyfermot in Dublin last night I know the guards have asked that the video is, isn't is circulated on, on social media but if you haven't seen it I mean it's um, it is vicious uh, there's two guards one of which is on the ground violently kicked and, and, and punched and another guard that appears to, to be pulled away um, and we're thinking of the two Gardaí involved in this uh, this incident last night. I know there have been arrests that, that have been made, but like, it's outrageous. How did we get to this? And whatever the circumstances, it's actually, it's totally irrelevant, really. How did we get to a situation where this has happened? And are we doing enough to protect the Gardaí going to work every single day? Like, can you imagine now if you're a guard heading off to work this afternoon? What, what, like, what is on your mind today? And have you experienced anything like this previously? If you're the family member of somebody in the force, I mean, I'm sure this crosses your mind day to day as well. So what needs to happen? Because there's going to be lots and lots of condemnation. And we're not just talking about this particular incident, but in general, because it's not the first time that we've talked about very similar situations here on the programme. Actually, only a couple of weeks back, we had a similar conversation about an incident in, in Dublin as well. So what needs to happen? Because all the politicians are going to be out today and making a lot of noise about this. And and rightly so, there'll be a lot of widespread condemnation of it. So these are the people who are the legislators. They actually are in power and have the power to provide better protections for the Gardaí. And if you were listening to the news bulletin there with Bernie a few moments ago, you'll have heard the GRA president, Brendan O'Connor, very simply mention the solution of body cameras and talking about international best practice. So why aren't they here? Because we've talked about it so many times on this programme alone, and I know on many, many other shows as well. But if the GRA are saying this is actually a big part of the solution to this, well then why don't we have it why don't we have that for the members of the force?